Hello, my name is Bud Alberry. I'm the business manager and financial secretary for Local 46 here in Seattle, Washington. We are talking to some of the brothers and sisters down here at the JETC today and interviewing them and seeing how they like the trade, how they got in the trade and what the trade has done for them. Hello, Amber. Hi. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself of how you started out and how you got into the IBW and what you did before? My name is Amber and I um, am an apprentice right now. And uh, how I got into the union was uh, really word of mouth. People telling me um, what a great opportunity this was for me and how much better it was than the jobs that I had seen before. Um, I was a office assistant before and I remember my boss at one time telling me that the most I was ever going to make was $17 an hour. I came into the trade more than that. So since you've been in the trade, have you learned a lot? Have you met a lot of good people? Yeah, I've uh, I've made some great connections. I know some great people. I work with some amazing people. Um, I learned so much every day. I got to ride a boom lift the other day and um, they just teach me some great skills that I can have to go on to be a better journeyman and uh, build a pension really. Since you've been into the JTC, how is the money and your pension and health and welfare compared to what you did before and what you see coming in the future? I've never seen uh, paychecks the way that I see them now. Um, what I used to see um, every other week, I now see weekly. Um, I have friends and family that come to me and they tell me, well, I'm only making this much a week. And I'm like, that that's it? Like that's, and then, then I'm like, oh, that must be weekly. And apparently it's every other week, so. As a sister out in the field, because I know you work with a lot of guys, uh, there's less women than guys. How do, how do you get along with the guys and how does that feel sometimes when you have to work with them? Uh, I feel like the guys are, they they treat me well. They work well with me. They, uh, they want me to succeed. I feel like they want me to work hard and uh, become a good journeyman. They've always told me that I'm their future, I'm their pension. So... <laughs> They always try to teach me how to do my job better and and what it takes to be a better journeyman. On, on your off hours when you're not at work, do you get involved with the union? Do you go to the meetings and picnics and stuff? I do, I do go to the meetings and I do go to the picnics. I think it's important to be involved in my union. It's given me so much. Um, so I like to give back to my union. You don't have a voice if you're not in there. And so it really takes getting in there and getting involved to have a voice. So I would say to anybody that's not in there that they should go and make themselves heard. Well, when you're out and when you're out and about and you run into people that aren't in the IBW and stuff, do you ever bump into people that you talk to them about the IBW and the benefits that they could have too if they came in? Yeah, that seems to be my pastime is okay. talking about my union and my work because I'm so proud of it and I'm so happy to be part of this. And I, I take such pride in my work and I take such pride in the fact that I'm a union member that it, I do talk about it a lot. <laughs> since, since you are in the IBW now, how has your life changed? Well, um, at one point I was on Section 8 and I was able to uh, get off Section 8 and then I was able to buy a house um, with the, the money that I earn. Uh, through my wages. That's excellent. Is it in the Seattle area? Yeah, I live in a federal way, so I'm still oh, okay. in the King County area. All right, that's fantastic. Yeah. Well, Amber, I'm really glad we got to sit and talk and yeah. get to know each other a little, and I hope that I see you more at the union meetings from now on, and hope we can talk and just be better friends. Yeah, I of really course. appreciate this. Thank yeah. you very much. Thank you.